What's going on, y'all? What's good, y'all? All right, so we back. You know, we got finished doing the um the trials with Nanaki, the the, the cool young buck, and brother Barrett kicked ass down there in the caves. Learned more about the gi. Well, actually, learned about the gi actually. But which actually was actually some really really good information. We had another trip uh, with Zach, who met up with our boy, who happens to still be alive. Which I, I actually do have some more theories on that too. I'm referring to Brother Biggs, but I I, I can't get stuck on this OST because it's just too good. Because everything is okay. <laughs> All right, let's um. Go, oh yeah, that's right. Cause we got a visitor up front. So let's go find out who that is. Don't be mad at me, y'all. Don't be mad because I'm enjoying this. Be mad at Square for having this OST so damn good. <laughs> boom, 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 boom. Boom, 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 boom. Beneath our veil, bound and stacked. Yep, excuse me, bruh. My bad. Nope, my bad. Oops. Y'all know we can't do this without making some type of noise. Ooh. Some goodies. Excuse us. Monarchy. Just as I thought. Is this man okay? He is, albeit rather weak. I'm not sure why, though. I know Mako poisoning when I see it, and this isn't it. Had a terminal. I'd bet my whiskers on it. It, uh, had a terminal. Cloud, remember what you told Gee an attack back there? That I might be weird, but you can trust me. Hey, well, even if you were lying, I'm gonna prove to you that you can trust me. That I'm on your side. Hmm. It's not that. We should go. Hey! <laughs> what? You're talking about heading to Nibelheim from here? There's no roads you can take far as I know. Maybe we can't go by land. But by air. Uh-huh. Meaning we'll need smoke. Right then. Back to the airstrip we go. 
Uh-oh. Cloud. What? Proto-Relic energy signature confirmed. And relatively close to you. While the signal is on the weaker side, it may serve as a good place to start. I'll send you the coordinates right away. Ooh. Appreciate you, chat. Is there a channel to work? Well, now I'm gonna go over here and check the board. I think I saw some new jobs over here. Ooh. Dude, you just called me. Stop tracking me, fam. Sky Watchers. We'll take the job. From whence life flows. We'll take the job. All right, team. Let's find out where we'll be going. Well, they're all in the city. The town. My bad, y'all. This is definitely a spiritual hotspot. Each day we share with it. We've got blooms for. Oh, I still didn't figure out where I'm going. Let's get outside the city first. Uh, out of town! That's how I can get away from this OST. <laughs> get out of here! Okay. So, we got the proto over here. Still got this fight going on down here. I still have this over here, which I need to try to figure out at some point. We are we about to take flight. Such a good chicken. Even though I have no idea where we're going. Let's figure it out. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Told y'all I was gonna get it. Told y'all. It shouldn't have took that long, but... <laughs> We got it done, y'all. Where's my check? Oh, wait. We got a fight. We got friends over here. Oh. 
Hey, where's my bird? Choco, 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 I'm on a choco boat. You're on a choco boat. What are you showing me? Ah. Hmm. Whoa. Oh crap. I think I screwed us. Oh Ooh. I thought I screwed us. Good shit. Ooh, 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 ooh. All right, we're right behind you, right behind you. Got too much more. Uh oh. You're in luck, Cloud. I've uncovered the location of a dangerous fiend. A vicious dragon seems to have awakened in the Cosmo Canyon region. A dragon. You must slay it, ere the fair earth is dyed an even darker red. Oh, we're gonna do that. That's an interesting spot. Is there anything else up here? Oh, okay, just this over here. Who's doing what? Get lost. Oh, there he is. Get going fast up now. I'm unstoppable. Got the right one. Never in doubt. There he is. Let's go, Birdie. We're in dangerous territory now. Rare Basilisk variant detected. Commencing guidance protocol. Pressure. Basilisk Stagger. Change defeat. the color of their skin to blend into the environment and hunt prey undetected. Shinra is studying this fiend in the hopes of replicating its camouflage capabilities. This variant, however, doesn't simply alter its coloration. It manipulates the properties of its skin in accordance with the temperature, humidity, and lighting of its surroundings. Its powers are nine ninja S. Be sure to rely on all your senses if you don't want to lose track of it. I right, will see what we can do. How we looking? Let's do our job. Now. What? Okay. There you are. <laughs> what? Keep it together. You won't regret this.
Everything's getting crazy out here. All right, we're good. I need you to run like a choco ball. That was actually one of the easier ones, y'all. Magnificent work, Cloud. Thank you. Have this region's fiends proved a fitting challenge? One glance at the data will tell you they are clearly no match for him. I don't recall asking you. If you haven't noticed, I'm trying to have a conversation with Cloud. So please quit. Cloud, if you're in need of a challenge, know that another combat trial awaits you. Yeah, he's such a bastard. Dude. <laughs> dude, you created her. <laughs> All right, let's check out this other joint. That's John right here. Got to do some investigations, y'all. More chickens. These ruins are closely connected with the life stream, and it's thought that they were created to help guide it through the veil. I have complete faith your efforts will greatly aid our planet. Whatever. To just be in the presence of the Nanaki is such an honor. Oh man, I got fans. Wait. <laughs> she hype. Precious material, where are you? No need to be shy, come out. You feel gonna take you home. Precious material, precious material, where are you? I know you guys. Yuffie. Good to see you! Billy Bob. You too. We were worried you might not have made it out in time. Nothing can kill this bloom. <laughs> Clearly. Hmm? Say, where's Sonon? Um... Yeah... Oh, uh, y'all don't know what went hey, down, bruh. You three! <gasps> Splinter Cell. Well, where are my manners? These guys are from Avalanche HQ. They're the ones who helped me out back in Midgar. And I don't think they need an introduction. Y'all were at the Shinra building, weren't you? Tell me, was Wedge with you? Or did you see him? <sighs> if you can tell me anything, anything at all, please. Wedge, he... I'm sorry. Don't be. Just... I need to know. Hmm. After the Sector 7 plate fell, the things we saw and heard, all the carnage, it was hell. We wanted to help, we really did. But how? It all seemed so hopeless. That's when the call came, from the folks at Avalanche HQ. We learned it was the company that dropped the plate, and that they were gonna drop another, unless we stopped them. HQ needed volunteers to help storm the Shinra building. This yeah. was our chance. We knew it was the right thing to do. All of us. Wedge and I ended up being assigned to the same truck. And holding a sandwich. We'll infiltrate the building via the underground parking facility. From there, we make our way up. Taking each and every floor. We've lost contact with Lucia's team. I think we have to assume they're all. That's enough. 
First, we'll check in with Matt. On it. Let me just scooch on over here. He has two sandwiches. I'm wet with the splinter sub. Uh, Barrett's crew, right? Mm -hmm. Here, uh, try one of these. It'll help you calm down. Thank you. Go on, eat up. As a fellow foodie, Our team was I appreciate that. To take out the president. I know what you're thinking. Avalanche doesn't do that. But when the plate fell, the rules changed. Come on, man. Get the let out. Don't want to be left behind. Hey, thanks for the assist. Oh. 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 Help me out of here. All right, we're almost there, boys. At long last, we're gonna take back our world, find the bastards who stole it, and send them to hell. Yeah! yeah. I've got friends up there who need to know we're coming. Oh, uh, sorry, but I didn't want them to get hurt, sir. <laughs> Go! I'll catch up! Right. We were all fired up. Ready to fight. Captain! You got me! Are you on this down and I've lost contact with the reserve? Y'all don't look that fired up. What y'all think? Bastard Couldn't ghost killed him. It was him. Thank you. Wow. <laughs> Damn it. Don't worry. It's all good, bro. Huh? Hey, y'all heard that, right? That was Wedge. Barrett, those who pass on become one with the live stream. I know what you thought you heard, but it was probably just the wind. <sighs> Whatever. In times past, the Cetra came to fonts like these to give thanks to the life stream. There aren't many left, so we wanted to help preserve the few still standing. It felt like the least we could do, you know? For all those who returned to the planet. Hey, Barrett, why don't we give him a hand? Help them spruce things up. There anything we can do for you? I don't know. Restore the planetary fonts? They're this region's main source of energy. Oh, and kind of okay. like relief valves for the life stream. But when they're as busted as this one here, you can't even get close to do repairs. Mako's way too dense. So we figured we'd use a probe to fix the fonts remotely. Thing is, little guy's just too Wally. old. Probably better off in a junkyard than with us. Perhaps I can be of service? Robotics is one of my areas of expertise. Meet Robot Chadley. <laughs> or Robo Chad, if you prefer something abridged. At any rate, you should now have complete control over him. Go on, ask him to do something. Yo, my headphones is dumb loud, y'all.
Don't got a little too much action in there. Gears and Gambit. Must program robots with gambits and actions that send them into battle. Aim at reacting to send up to spring and vanquishing the enemy leader. Emerging victorious or restored to plans to respawn. Okay! Three types of robots can be deployed to each operating in accordance with the gamuts. And actions which are programmed prior to the battle. Gamuts determine the target, actions determine the robot target. For the first battle, let us let the AI set let us chat leave us. Yeah. Lightning beats fire, fire beats ice, ice beat lightning. Okay, I think I got it. Three minutes. Robots can be deployed from any of three portals and move along the way towards the enemy lead in the center. Press X to eat. Press X to view each purple robot canvas action. Icons above the foes HP gauge and if you're not illegal defenses. Try to deploy the robots and exploit these vulnerabilities. Let's do it. The ATB gauge in the bottom left slowly fills almost. The mouth. Deploy another robot. The ATB calls for the type of various cords to each gambit in actions. Try deploying another unit once the ATB gauge is simply oh. Gotcha. Okay. Dead. As you can see, pressing L2 or R2 switching between portal allows you to play robots and different lanes and other. Oh, we got a whole we're getting a squad out there. Square allows you to view them in units and such campus and actions. The same method can be also be used to view the robots remaining ability uses. Okay. Dude, let me do something. Got a special photo shift between the both by pressing triangle. The pad left right to select the special special. Oh wow. Okay. How cool does that sound? Go get him, buddy! Bite! Let's do it! works all right so we gotta get him out of here all right i got it i figured the time was for something Back up, fam. Oh. One, too bad.
It's actually kind of easy. of ancient texts. I've deduced this place was built by the Cetra to house something alien. Alien? Precisely what is unclear. I remember hearing about this growing up. You don't think they were talking about the Gi, do you? Hmm. Perhaps. But the energy signature would suggest otherwise. Given that it so strongly resembles that of a proto-relic, I surmise these structures were designed to contain one. For now, let's continue to restore them. I'm sure we'll find something within. The planet itself is guiding us. I've also developed an additional AI chip for RoboChat. No, for Wally. Expedites our work. Hey, <laughs> We ain't never scared. Oh. Got him. He tried to use the speed up too. This is like Fort Condor. We all talked about coming out to see I'm actually enjoying this better though. That night at the bar, remember? Yeah. You guys were trying some new cocktails for me. Mmm. Yep. This is the one. Bartender! Whip me up another Costa del Sol. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Girl, you already lit. Cutting you up. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Come on, <laughs> one more couldn't hurt. Now me, I'm a Cosmo Canyon guy. Mm, that one was pretty good, but it was missing that special flourish. Guess what I got? Huh? Ta-da! Cosmo. Oh, that thought. Can't call it a Cosmo Canyon without a touch of local flavor. Because I've been dealing with music issues. A dash of this will make all the difference. I'm about to see if I can turn the music off real quick. It's mined from the canyon itself, the birthplace of planetology, and pretty hard to come by, I'll have you know. Oh my god. Because YouTube, you suck. It's got to be laced with something. Wow. Oh, this is square. You're right. One of y'all. It's like a whole new drink. Man, it's too bad the stuff is so hard to come by. If only I had more. I thought you might say that. But up a whole Damn. so you can keep on mixing. Wedge a real one. But those will only last us so long. Especially if this Cosmo Canyon becomes a hit. 
Gonna need to stock up. In that case, what about a trip to the source, huh? We could all bring back as much salt as we could carry. What do you say? Count me in. Home of Planetology, here we come! It's gonna be great! We don't even know what she's saying right now. Really? Huh? Y'all think we got money to be taking field trips? Cause our books say otherwise. <laughs> here. Shit, we gotta go. <laughs> there you have it. The boss himself says it's a done deal. Well, that changed mighty you fast. Are generous leader. <laughs> to to Barrett. Barrett. Honestly, y'all are just too much. <laughs> <laughs> and she can't even walk. Look, guys, we made it. Would have liked to have gotten here sooner, but. Wait, you fixed it already? Yeah, y'all late. Hey, just a go slow, folks. Come on, double time. Coming. Hey, four more. Nice. Barrett's big on tough love, huh? Maybe I ought to try to return the favor. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't think you're tough enough, young buck. <laughs> Does that catch you sleeping? Yeah, thanks to Cloud. This battle system is crazy. Not bad. Uh oh. Careful, Cloud. You have just entered Jabberwock territory. Jabberwock. Unfortunately, we know very little about this enigmatic fiend at present. I suggest you expect the unexpected. Hmm. What are we looking like? Get off. Get ourselves ready. Get right. We really don't need the the ether. We'll see. Let's get into this fight. Ooh, let's go. No, it's still got to stay out of the way. Alright, let's get the assassin. A legendary dragon that sleeps at the bottom of the canyon is on here and creature has lived in eons. Much like the minerals in the body much are symbols. The surrounding equipment suffers from damage and the time awakens from one of the slumpers. Fire is his weakness? I don't think I would have guessed that. Did you see that big dog? Resist it. Dude, you're still talking. 
Don't overdo it. Uh, let's spark it up. And then let's get more Yuffie. Get ugly out here. Okay, now open up. It's on you. I'm your one stop clobbering shot. You're not going to be hurt like that. Taking over. Uh oh. Shit. My bad. I'm glad. You beat. Take to do this to you. Take me. Here I go. I'm unstoppable. Careful. Just you watch. Watch and learn. Watch and learn. Uh, he go down this time, he in trouble. No Alright, Cloud. Let's do it, baby. Let's dance, asshole. How did I not kill? I guess you gotta take him out. Excellent work out there, Cloud. Thanks to you, we've obtained invaluable intel. The study of such ancient creatures will surely provide insight into the region's history. <sighs> All you ever care about is your intel. It wouldn't kill you to show a little concern for Cloud's well-being, you know? You aren't hurt. Are you, Cloud? No, we, we good. We good. <laughs> you worry too much, Mai. Rest assured that I always keep a close eye on you. Who cares? You. I can tell at a glance if you suffered any injuries. In fact, Cloud, I guarantee that I know more about your physical condition than you do. That's a considerably rare material, Cloud. That worries me. I suspect it will prove useful in crafting new creations. I suggest you hold on to it. Three to go. I'm your one stop club right shot. Hey, he's not he is not fucking around. My turn. There we go. This ends here. Now's our chance. So now's our chance. God damn it. Keep leading, leading us astray. Oh, I must be up here. Oh, they actually beat us here. Take 
Magic Ant. Well, well, y'all beat us to the punch for once. Right. Not that it mattered. We still can't reach the font. Man, there's a weird fiend. Got any smart ideas? <laughs> Ask and you shall receive. I've prepared an additional AI chip. It should allow you to progress further. Just mind the monsters. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Get your bitch ass out of here, bruh! Get your bitch ass! Think that did the trick? Yep, this font's good to go. Man, we really are dead weight, aren't we? Yep. We're just slowing you down. You in the way, bitch.
All right, I think we're on the right track this time, team. What the hell? Okay, guys. Gloves up. Rare copper wire variant detected. Commencing guidance protocol. Lacking both visual and auditory senses, the copper wire tracks prey through vibrations in the ground, unleashing a relentless stream of precise attacks with its whip-like vines. Because copper wire tendrils are both supple and sturdy, humans have used them as a material for handicrafts throughout history. The vines of this particular variant are resistant to fire. A house wrapped in them could burn to the ground, and the tendrils would remain. There's no telling what untapped potential these plant fiends possess. Untapped. We're counting on you to help us find out. Great. Yeah, we should be alright. Let's get going. Hey! Fucker! Assess time. Ice. Makes sense. You need to chill. Yeah, you heard him. You need to chill. I didn't get the pressure. What? Very impressive work, Cloud. You've completed this region's combat assignments. Such harsh environments as these are bound to engender fiends as brutal as their habitat. They might have gotten the better of you, if not for my informative and entertaining guidance. Isn't that right, Chadley? The data we've collected from the fiends you fought has helped us create a new combat trial. I hope you'll find it useful. Don't ignore me! <laughs> A little disrespectful to my girl. The vines of this particular okay. That's it. Alright. Uh -huh. What the hell? We're looking. It's on you. You're in good hands now. Where? Get up. What are you doing? Congratulations. You managed to complete all intel objectives. Wait. Ready for a motherfucking smackdown? Okay.
Ain't no thing. Oh yeah, I know, but up here. No time to celebrate. Oh, what's up, fellas? Hey! Dirt. Nope. Keep it together. Let's do this, you? Who you Got his ass right out of there. Oh. Oh. Dang! Let's finish. Nothing to it. We run out of ether. There was a chill spot around here somewhere. Doesn't look like the HQ squad's here yet. Oh, great. There's still one more left. Get down. Damn, I only went over here because it seemed convenient. I know you're around here, Mr. Treasure Chest. Cool. Never turned down some money.